Now, let us solve the mystery of opening the chain stitch. So the chain stitch to open, you have to see how the pants were done. And then you have to go to the other side because you open where they finish the stitch. And look at that. I slide my seam ripper under stitch and yank. Now the chain is broken and I just need to pull it. Huh, that was easy, right? Sometimes if you do that, it doesn't open. So just go to the back part and make sure to open around three stitches and then go back to the front and uh, it's already done. You see, you pull again and it's done. You see, there are two ways to open the savage way or the smart way. I like this savage way. I'm wild. Shh. Hmm. <laughs> Satisfying, right? Oops. If the thread breaks, you just open another loop and here you go. Now let's go with the open the search. Usually what I do, I just put my seam ripper and open. But if you have to open a lot, like we did four seams, then the best way to do is just to cut just the top part, like a 1 16 of the inch. And, uh, you know, 132, like you lose a little bit of the seam allowance but it's completely worth it because after you do that you pull it hmm that's even more satisfying i think what do you think if you encounter something that is not cut just check cut again and just be sure that it's all going well and smooth you see cut pull cut pull very nice right so as you can see you can save a lot of time doing that for opening the waistband most of the waistband comes with the chain stitch you just pull the chain you know or you can put your razor inside and cut the material the loop will cut and you just pull it out See, it's extremely easy. The bell loop is another tricky one. You have to be careful, very, very careful. You will start by shaving inside and you very, very gentle until you more or less see that you have shaved enough and then you go very carefully. And now you just pull the upper part and it's open. I will finish these stitches with my blade. The side seam is the trickiest one. Guys, if you find a way that is easier than the one that I will explain you, please let me know in the comments. The first thing that I'm gonna do, I will open the tag that is at the end of the side seam. For that, I will do the same. I shave inside, and then if I need a little bit more shaving, I do it outside, just to be sure that the thread is loose. And then when I go back inside, pull, make sure that it's open here you go now what i'm gonna do i will open i will break the stitches like uh, every three stitches or so this is the best way that i have found and then after that i go in the inside and pull the thread and uh, as you can see the thread goes but you really have to pull hard sometimes you have to go one stitch at the time because it's not really the best one and then after that you know you keep using the trick with the search and then you open and here you go the side is open my next stitch to open is the pocket it's not really a difficult one the only part there is the tack and uh, you just have to be careful pulling and breaking the thread where the tack is and as soon as you have this part done everything else goes very smoothly i use my blade and i go very careful and uh, the thing what i do is i go and make sure that the blade is shifted to the pocket side because if i break the material i wanted to break it in the pocket and not in the pants but of course i'm very careful so guys that was an excerpt from my last video i realized that my last video was a little bit too long and i didn't want you to miss this part so i hope this helps if you like it please don't forget to subscribe like share bye